In Wisconsin, residents and survivors are mourning the victims of Sunday's shooting massacre at a Sikh temple in Oak Creek. Six people were killed and several injured, including a police officer. The shooter, identified as 40-year-old Wade Michael Page, was killed by police. At a press conference today, a member of the Sikh community read the names of those killed. Sita Singh, 41 years old, male. Ranjit Singh, 49 years old, male. Satwan Singh Kaleka, 62 years old, male. Prakash Singh, male, 39 years old. Paramjit Kaur, 41 years old, female. Shubhaik Singh Khattara, 84 years old, male. Satwant Singh Kaleka, one of the founders and leaders of the Gurdwara or temple, was killed trying to stop the shooter. His son, Amar Deep, described to TMJ4 what he learned about his father's last moments. He attacked uh, the intruder or the shooter in the lobby after gunshots were fired, uh, got to him, there's a blood struggle, um, evidence shows on the ground a blood struggle, and then my uh, father's blood trail back to one area and the shooter's trail towards the kitchen. And at that point, what goes through my mind is, you know, my father did his best to protect the, the temple, but also my family and his wife and all his friends and, and people that were there. Um, and he slowed the shooter down enough so other people could get to safety. And that's, I mean, it's an amazing act of heroism, but it's also exactly who he was. There'd be no way in, in God's green earth that he would allow somebody to come in and do that without trying his best to, to stop it. Two priests were also killed, including Parkash Singh, who'd recently brought his wife and children from India to live in Oak Creek, located near Milwaukee. The shooting began Sunday morning as congregants gathered ahead of a service. Some were preparing a community meal in the kitchen, children were downstairs studying. Although the shooter was killed, many hid for over an hour before police escorted them out. The shooting comes just over two weeks after another massacre in Aurora, Colorado, killed 12 and injured dozens. At a press conference this morning, Oak Creek Mayor Steve Scafidi said it's a tragic day for the community. Oak Creek is a diverse, welcoming city. We, have, we host 23 places of worship, and the Sikh community is part of that, what makes our city strong. We will recover from this, but I want to assure everyone that we are doing everything we can, cooperating with federal agencies, local and state agencies, to get the answers we need to resolve the situation and to begin the healing process. Multiple law enforcement agencies are involved in the investigation, including the U.S. Attorney General's Office and the FBI, which is examining whether the shooting was an act of domestic terrorism. The shooter, Wade Michael Page, is connected to white supremacist groups. According to the Southern Poverty Law Center, he played in two bands that produced racist songs and imagery, and he'd associated with white supremacist musical groups and gatherings for over a decade. At today's press conference, reporters questioned FBI agent Teresa Carlson on what authorities knew about his affiliations. We did not have an active investigation on him prior to yesterday. He, there may be references to him in various files. Those are things that are being analyzed right now. But we had no reason to believe, and as far as I know, no law enforcement agency had any reason to believe that he was planning or plotting or capable of was such he violence. The Bureau as a white supremacist as an extreme? I'm not going to discuss any um, details of the specifics in terms of what constitutes a white supremacist and whether or not you know he fits that description at this point. As the investigation continues in Wisconsin, Sikhs across the world expressed grief and shock. Harpal Singh is the priest at the Sikh Religious Society of Indiana. His brother-in-law is also a priest in another Sikh temple in Milwaukee. I started by asking Mr. Singh how he found out about the shooting and what was his reaction. Somebody told me, as you heard, I heard from the news, and I called my sister this morning. She told that one person came inside. We have a service, the first service that was uh, ended actually that time. So he came inside, entered inside first. Uh, he sh uh, shot the uh, maybe the women when he first entered inside, and then maybe he knew before inside the every place. So he got inside the room where the other 
priest was the sitting actually two priests they killed he killed two priests actually do you see this as a religious hate crime uh, i personally I, i don't know what was the motive actually nobody knows so far actually because the, the shooter also died from the police bullet so th- this is a, so far the mystery they are just investigating so what was the motive actually you cannot say because unless you find out Mm. I mean, generally speaking, how do you feel relations are between Sikhs living in your area and the rest of the community? Yeah, we are very fine, actually. We don't have any problems since then. I, I have been living in this area, in this temple, for the last 18 years, actually, even though because I go everywhere and uh, because this is a very small town. That was Harpal Singh, a priest with the Sikh Religious Society of Indiana, giving us his reaction to Sunday's shooting at the Sikh temple in Wisconsin. You're listening to Free Speech Radio News.